Leave me be. This episode was actually quite fun, but once more, it didn't really involve like Taya and what makes him him. A little bit of his backstory. Like, here's the thing: I'm not saying that. Oh my God, we should have gotten the entire backstory from the beginning to the end now. But it's like, hey, you could have, you could have given us an old, old nugget. We didn't talk about the fucking. Wh why does he want to be firefighter? Why? The fuck he wants to ride a lion. But bring back the CEO of the company from like episode 11 was quite fun. It is insane that it's been 11 weeks since episode 11. I am getting older by the fucking minute. I don't give a shit. While also it was quite vindicating to see Tyre very much confused that like, oh, you were surprised that I'm Boon Red? I'm, I wasn't even trying to even fucking hide it. I literally transformed on TV once. So pretty much he went to the CEO or at least the CEO kind of came to him with another delivery service, which is delivering illegal firearm to a bunch of kids. It, it's just some fireworks for his nephew because he's camping and hey, it's summer. It's a Japanese summer tradition. Come on, go watch uh, like fucking SSSS Dinazenon. Here's the thing, it's kind of funny that we got more lore about the CEO that I don't even remember his name than Taya. Now we know he's not a single child. So now what we need to pinpoint is does he have a brother or a sister? But it was kind of odd that the entire forest inhabited anyone that was important to the episode for no apparent reason, really. Well, it did really inhabit the lion, it didn't really inhabit the lion fire truck, but this one was for later. Like the Shiren Trio and Sakito, which I like that the Shiren Trio made the stupidest monster ever. Like they made a tent monster, which capture people inside of tents, but like their heads is still out, which you can clearly see the zipper and 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 no one really tried to, you know, unzip the zipper. But well, when Sakito got captured and returned to help Taya in the fight before the mech fight and slightly before Taya transformed into Boon Red 119, uh, like he came in with the tire pretty much torn to shit. So maybe, maybe there were very strong zippers. Like, here is the thing. This episode didn't really have a lot. Like, this was a fun episode, but like... In the story variety, boy, this th this wasn't a lot. Like, it had really great fights in. I did kind of like, like, getting more of the focus on Taya. But it's just like, in episodes that are slightly meaningless, or when they're focused on Taya, the real focus are like the Hashirians. So, I don't know. But I did really like, like, the fight scenes. The fight scenes were fun. Like, the lion fire truck is funny and kind of cool because it's just a fire truck that transforms into a lion. Did like that Boken Silver Mech fucking uh, reference? I don't know. Sakito didn't really do a lot in this episode. It kind of feels like, oh, they Toei kind of mandatorily said to the writing room, hey, in this episode, the, the six ranger need to appear in. And they kind of like rushed it to the point of like, oh, we don't know what to do with him. And here's the thing, it's not like I uh, like a Jiro from Dawn Brothers situation when like fucking uh, Hasagao didn't really want to do anything with him. Like literally the fucking like Dawn Brothers, the show that literally told you we don't want to do anything with him did kind of more, which is funny. But uh, yeah, like 
I don't know what to say. I kind of did like the references that, like, hey, but Joe and fucking Chashiro, like, we want fucking, like, really cool, like, upgrades too. Come on. Like, I think Boon Black, like, uh, 110 looks cool. Boon Blue 007 is very much nearing a fucking copyright claim from, I don't know, the company that owns, like, James Bond, I don't fucking know, like, I have a, like, the only actual, like, James Bond movie that I remember really liking is Skyfall, because I remember No Time to Die was quite shit, but it could be misremembering No Time to Die, uh, but yeah, like, uh, this episode was, at least from my memory, better than No Time to Die, this one gets a C+. Plus. So, uh, yeah, what you thought about uh, Boon Boon Jar episode 22? Comment below, let me know. What do you think Breaks and Miro's fucking upgrade numbers would be? Because that could be fun. I don't know. Mira 420. Blazing. So, uh, yeah, if you like the video, please like the video. Uh, if you already didn't subscribe to my channel, please, like, the subscribe button is still on that goal to become a subscribe button. Let's just try to pass, I don't know, Mr. Beast. That's my goal now. I'm going to surpass Mr. Beast. So, yeah, don't forget. You're the only one that can prevent forest fires. And have a great rest of your day. Bye-bye.